squids! It's Friday, July 7th, and today I decided that uh, I'm going to be doing a weigh-in because it's been like a hot, hot minute that I haven't done a weigh-in. And last night I woke up with the biggest craving for sweets. It was awful. And I know that part of it has a lot to do with me like jumping on and off keto, but I think I'm also gonna get my period, which could probably be the other factor. Um, anyways, I didn't break it. I was really good. I just had some little pork rinds and satisfied and then I just drank lots and lots and lots and lots of water so now about me breaking the keto diet it hasn't been as bad as I may sound or make it sound um, I realized that I probably being a little too hard on myself which is very normal for me and I think for a lot of people it's a very normal thing to do to just be like I effed it all up why you know what I mean um, I do that too so don't feel bad um, I have been breaking it but it's been either like a one meal thing and then it's like every two to three days I haven't been vlogging a lot and I'm actually gonna vlog today and I'm gonna tell you guys kind of what's been happening I would say in the past uh, since like June 30th I think was my last uh, uh, official edited um, or 4th of July but by 4th of July you'll see that somebody wasn't there so um, anyways yeah I'll, I'll talk all about that in my vlog and um, what was I talking about okay so because I haven't been vlogging as much it seems like I've just been posting the videos where I just eat crappy but the reality is throughout the days I've actually been pretty good it's only like I said been a meal um, except for that one day and then I realized that that day that I ate carbs it wasn't even a lot but I felt like I ate for 20 people and I really do think that's because my body's finally adjusting like girl get your get yourself together why are you feeding me things that you don't want to feed me but um, like I said those cravings I think it has a lot to do with I think I'm gonna get my period uh, but yes it's been uh, like I said quite some time that I haven't done my weigh in so I, I figured it was time and regardless of the results which I'm hoping I I'm hoping I lost at least one pound because I've been doing pretty good these this past week um, but regardless of the results um, the purpose of the Wayans is to document my journey and it's not going to be perfect. So I'm just going to bite the bullet and go with myself. <laughs> nervous as I feel. Okay, here we go. Here is the scale. Oh, yay, mission accomplished. 304. Okay, so there it is, 304. I accomplished my mission of at least losing one pound. My last win was at 305.2 um, and you know what that's okay that's okay I feel like getting under the 300s is so close yet so far away so in this very moment I feel like it's a perfect time to say that well we all know this right weight loss isn't easy like we have an idea and we probably say it and we start it but I just realized that sometimes you look up to other people and you know if you, that's if you're looking up to me or you, and, and even I do this to myself when I I look at someone's pages and see their progress and their success and yes although it's been a pound guys it's been three weeks that I haven't done away and all I lost was a pound I'm not gonna beat myself up for it it's still a pound loss and just realize that when you post and or when you watch someone on social media I just felt like I have to say this. It's not what they always post. Like, we all know this, and I think we all have an idea of understanding to a certain extent that everyone's gonna post a certain aspect of their life on social media, um, especially if they're they're documenting their weight loss. But it's so hard to get that visually. It's so hard even documenting it. Like, I try to be as real as possible, but the reality is I don't record myself 24 seven. And I try to record, um, as you know like I like I did the other day where I was feeling not so well and I'm just like you know what I, I feel like I have to talk this out and you know some you know God spoke and I just had this heartfelt feeling to want to talk about it because it's it's like friendship you know you talk to your friend they listen to you you vent you feel their heart feeling for you feeling empathy and that's a beautiful thing and that's why I decided to do that so I try to do as much as that as possible but the reality, like I said, is I don't feel myself 24-7. So just know that if you are 
also back and forth and you're following someone or even myself and you just constantly see progress it's not all it's cracked up to be and i am learning not to beat myself up for it um i really am a pound is a pound it's kill still going down even though it's a pound um, but that's gonna lead me to the next thing I quickly want to talk about which is kind of now that I've been doing keto for quite some time last time I talked about it I kind of gave up some tips and I just kind of want to give a general overview of how amazing it is in this particular aspect going on and off um, a lot of the other diets that I've done in general or change of lifestyle with my diet is been hard to jump back in I mean to the point where I mean even my documentation is evidence of that where I will take off for two months I have never broken a diet that has taken me literally the next day to jump right back on and be able to be honest about it and say you know what guys today I'm gonna hang out with my sister and I'm gonna eat carbs and sugar all day because that's what I want to do and then jump right back on it and after three weeks of being on keto for like four days and then eating something carby and then you know gaining a pound or two and this and that still do a weigh in and still manage to lose a pound I've never felt so amazing um, as far as like I and maybe it has a lot to do with keto and probably a lot that I've been able to overcome through this journey I'm sure that like I said that that could definitely be a factor and that's just gonna take time but I think that the keto diet has been the best when it comes to that because you feel so lean even if I'm not dropping drastically a I feel it in my clothes which I'm gonna start including a lot more because I feel like it's a, been a big part and had I known, I mean, obviously it's a journey, so it's not like I'm gonna plan out my journey, but had I known that eventually I was gonna do keto, I would have definitely tested out a lot of clothes that were a lot tighter and like the difference now. And I know some of it has to do with the pounds lost, but being on keto, it's more than that. Like I feel leaner and that is what helps you, even though from the outside you may still be like, I'm not where I want to be, but on the inside because you're feeling lean, you're gaining confidence that you never thought you had. Um, and I'm somewhat of a confident person for the most part. Like I'm not afraid to show my body or be in it because it's the body that I'm currently in and I'm not, like I'm getting to a point where I want to be healthier, but it is the body that I'm in and I feel beautiful. But the lean leanness, you know, at, at that, hadn't I hadn't felt in a very long time so that I'm very happy about and I just wanted to talk about that aspect because I think it's something that gets overseen a lot a lot of people kind of go into the scientific part of keto which is awesome and I, I think it's something great and I, I I will eventually share as I'm continuing to learn but um, I like sharing feelings guys and that's how I feel today um, and I'm excited about, you know, just continuing this journey. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you are not a subscriber, go ahead and subscribe and follow me on this weight loss journey and also on my vlogs because I think I'm a pretty cool person. So you may think so too. I'm just saying, let's be friends. Um, anyways, I will see you all on my next video. Bye. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow me on all my social media at I am Lolo, and don't forget to subscribe.